Hey everybody, how you doing? Today, we're shooting a 25 pound dumbbell. At least I think that's what they're called. I don't work out, so I don't really know, but we're shooting a 25 pound weight with 30 caliber rifles. This is gonna be a whole lot of fun. Lined up here, we have a 30-30, then a 308, then a 30 out six, and then a 300 Win Mag. I have a new respect for the 300 Win Mag today because in another video, I shot that 300 Win Mag clear through some AR-500. This should be a really fun video. I have no idea what happens. I'm pretty sure that the 300 Win Mag is gonna take a chunk out of this weight and the rest of them are just gonna bounce off. Put a comment down below and let me know if you think if any of these 30 caliber rifles are even gonna put a dent in this dumbbell. These suckers are pretty hard, but let's start shooting. I'm gonna start with the 30-30. Let's see what happens. First shot with the 30-30. This is a Winchester Model 94. That's pretty far ways away for these open sights, but see if we can hit that baby down there. This is a very accurate rifle. Let's go down there, take a look at the damage. So, walking up to it, dumbbell was sitting up on that stump there, knocked it just back behind it. Oh, let's see what happened here. You can see that we absolutely hit it square in the middle there with the 3030 and kind of messed up the metal a little bit, took the bottom of the five off. Pretty awesome. Let's go load up the 308, see if it puts the hurt on this dumbbell any more than the 3030 did. All right, now we're loading up the 308. This is a Ruger American rifle. See what happens. Definitely hit it there. Let's go check out the damage. Walking up to it here, it didn't knock it back down as far away as the 3030 did. You can see right there where we hit it with the 308. It definitely took a little chunk of metal out of there, but I don't think it damaged it near as bad as the 3030. It also didn't knock it back as far. So right now, I think the 3030 is definitely winning. Let's go load up the 30 out six, see what happens. Now we got a Ruger American in 30 out six. I think I failed to mention both the 308 and the 30 out six here are 180 grain bullets. See what we can do with this 30 out six. We definitely hit it. Oh. Go down there and see what happened. This time, both the log and the weight flew a little bit further back. You can see here, the 30 out six, we hit just above where we shot with the 308. The indentation is a little bit deeper than the 308, but still didn't do as much damage, as much smack down here as the 30-30. Let's go see what happens with the 300 Win Mag. This is gonna be a good one. Last shot here. This is with a Remington 770 chambered in 300 Win Mag. I don't think it's gonna break it a big chunk off, but it's definitely gonna show us something. Whew. Gonna show my shoulder something too, I tell you that. The scopes on all these rifles, by the way, are beautiful. I'll put the links to these scopes in the description down below if you want to check them out. Yeah, buddy. I see we knocked it clean off the log. This is the one that I'm excited to see what happens with this big boy right here. Let's go check it out. So walking up to the dumbbell here, the wind mag definitely knocked the weight back the furthest, but let's take a look at the weight and see what happened. The 300 Win Mag hit right here. And if you look close, it actually put some cracks through there. Definitely put a big, big hole down in there. Much more than the 3030 did, and a whole lot more than the 308 or the 30 out 6 did. The 300 Win Mag definitely won this one, but still didn't break a piece off this dumbbell. Definitely put a big old dent in it, but didn't break it off. Those suckers are real, real hard. But if you don't have a 300 Win Mag, you probably need one. I recommend it. 
Thanks for watching the video, guys. Huge shout out and a big thanks to Heavy Metal Guns and Outdoors for all your support. Couldn't have made this video without you. Don't forget to subscribe to the Hootie Hoo channel if you haven't already. Share this video with all your friends. Stay tuned for the next one, guys. Hootie Hoo!